Obvious signs of, of muskrat presence and muskrat damage is the erosion caused by abandoned dens and runs. Um, the dens and runs that you, you see here, there's multiple dens and runs. It's an obvious indication you have muskrats and a muskrat problem. This is a typical muskrat run into a den entrance that's gone into your, your pond levee here. It could start causing erosion. Your banks will collapse. It could possibly cause uh, your pond levee or your pond dam to leak. But again, it's pretty obvious. You can see a nice distinct run where they've burrowed out. The bottom of this run will be pretty hard where they've eliminated all the silt and mud and it'll go back into a uh, above ground chamber. And the simplest solution on muskrats is what we call a body grip trap or a conibear. It's a very humane trap. It's very effective and very safe to use as far as if you have pets or anything. Simply set and it's going to go into the run and as the muskrat goes into its den or burrow it's going to trip the trap and it's going to collapse down on him and it's going to euthanize him very very quickly so it's a very humane very safe trap you don't have to worry about people or pets getting caught in this but very effective for removing muskrats in a problem situation where they're causing damage this is a stanchion it just helps set the trap and hold it in place for us you don't have to use these but it makes it pretty simple and all you're going to do is place it down in that run so the muskrat has to go through it to get into their den. Usually it'll solve the problem in 24 hours. After you remove the muskrats typically you'll want to fill in the, the runs and the burrows. Ideally since this pond the water levels down you'll want to come back in with rock and rock it about three foot up and three foot down to prevent any further damage or muskrats moving back into the pond. Very simple, very safe, and very effective.